Time now for Back to the Basics in Healthcare with Balanced Life Chiropractic. We have Dr. Harley joining us. How are you doing, Dr. Harley? Hey, John. I'm doing fantastic. Man, is the weather nice. Oh, it? yeah. This, and we had like rain. Uh-huh. We had kind of this, uh, our April showers came late, which was nice because I planted some grass and I'm hoping that'll, uh-huh. that'll grow. But when the weather is nice, that makes people happier and more cheerful and it uh-huh. more positive mental health, doesn't it? Right. Yeah. So May is Mental Health Awareness Month. So I figured we should talk a little bit about how chiropractic can help with mental health. A lot of people might not necessarily associate chiropractic with mental health issues. But there's a mind and body connection because if you've got pain in all kinds of places in your body, then your mind is going to be thinking about that. And that really makes everything else difficult, doesn't it? Right. You know, uh, when a lot of mental health like depression, anxiety can stem from some sort of physical injury or chronic pain that you're in, because when you don't feel good, you know, you're like you said, you're going to be focusing on that. You're you're not going to be thinking very positively, and that's you know, it's just going to kind of continue to get worse. So that's one way we see by helping someone improve their physical ailment, it's going to gr- drastically improve their mental health. But there are some people too that it's like you know they weren't necessarily here for their mental health issues or they had a lot of aches and pains, but their mental health improved. Like, well, how did that work? You know, our the nerves in our upper neck, you know, they go back up into our head. So that's like our brain talking to our brain. And if there's issues up there and our brain's not communicating very well with itself, it's going to lead to some distortion. It's going to lead to more issues. So that can lead to mental health issues. If our brain's just not functioning like it should, it's going to be harder to overcome the stress you have in your everyday life. And a lot of stress is what leads to a lot of anxiety, depression type issues. And there are some people who think the answer is, oh, you need medication. Because if you have medication for all of these things, it's going to fix everything. Well, that can actually cause more problems, really, can it? Yeah, there are some medications that a side effect is mental health issues. Or it will say, don't take this medication if you are diagnosed with anxiety, depression, whatnot. And then, you know, so make sure that if you are, you know, suffering with some of those things, talk to your doctors, make sure your medication is not having any of those side effects. But medication isn't always going to fix the problem, right? A lot of times it just kind of covers it up. It's not really addressing the issue. Or what we find with chiropractic is we're helping your nervous system to function better, helping your brain to function better. Your body's working better. It's going to help heal itself. We're going to be able to handle our stress better. We're not going to get so overreactive to our everyday normal stressors. Anxiety is going to start to be reduced. You know, we're going to start feeling better. So then our depression starts, you know, we have a better mood. You know, talking about like the nicer weather, that kind of stuff, like all those things, you know, really start adding up, helping to boost our mute, our mood. Absolutely. And one of the things I would encourage people to do before jumping on a medication of some kind, see if there's a better plan. And I think one of the things that's nice about chiropractic, it's a very much a holistic way where it's very rare that, that you talk to a chiropractor that's going, oh, hey, I think you need to be on all of these drugs to fix it. Because there's most of the time, probably not all the time, but a lot of the time, there's an answer that's not including drugs, and there's a way for you to maybe uh, get that mental health back in check uh, in a natural way. Mm-hmm. So chiropractic, it really does help people heal without the use of drugs or surgery, helping your body to heal itself from the inside out. Now, yes, of course, there are definitely cases where you should be taking your medication. I'm not going to tell you what medications to take or not to take. That's a conversation between you and your primary. But if you're looking for other answers, looking for a way to manage your health issues without drugs or surgery, chiropractic is a fantastic way to help your body help itself. If somebody listening is maybe have questions and are going, hey, I'd like to maybe chat with Dr. Harley and find out if this chiropractic thing is for me, how do they get a hold of you and what's the first step in that process? The first step is, yeah, getting a hold of us and setting up a new patient appointment. So you can give us a call at 605-215-1785. You can reach out to us on our Facebook page at Balanced Life Chiropractic. We'd love to chat and let you know how we can help. You know, the new patient appointment, we are doing like a thorough health consultation. We're using some exams at our office to really pinpoint where your underlying issues are coming from. It's a great system. And you can find them online as well. And they've got the phone number there and a link to the Facebook page there as well at balancedlifesd.com.